Hey everyone, today we've got some heated drama to dive into. Deion Sanders' confidant has fired back at Gavin Kuld for making some serious and potentially damaging accusations against Shador Sanders. Buckle up, because this one's intense. Hey guys, what's up? Welcome to my channel ATN Sonics, your top destination for Colorado Buffalo's football updates and the latest news on Deion Sanders. Our channel offers a mix of news, analysis, and exclusive videos and highlights to keep you informed and entertained. Stay ahead of the game by hitting subscribe and joining our community of passionate sports enthusiasts. Let's dive in. So here's the deal. Gavin Kuhl's post-exit actions have caused quite a stir, not just among critics, but also among members of the Buffaloes, especially Shador Sanders and Justin Mayers. And while Deion Sanders has stayed quiet, his confidant, Uncle Neely, has stepped up to address the issue. On the DNVR Sports Podcast, Uncle Neely didn't hold back in criticizing Cool for his actions after leaving the team, particularly his attack on Shador. Neely believes that severing ties with the bridge that helped his growth was a big mistake on Cool's part. According to Neely, this decision could lead Cool down a path similar to his former teammate, Cormani McLean's. Neely didn't mince words on the podcast. He held Cool accountable for not making the most of his opportunities with the Buffaloes despite receiving the best treatment in Colorado. Instead of taking a stand for Coach Prime or Shador, Neely put the spotlight on Kuld and questioned his decision-making. He pointed out that Kuld could have used his time with the Buffaloes as a stepping stone to a better future, but instead, he chose to burn bridges. Now, according to Neely, Kuld has limited options moving forward because he severed those important relationships. As for Kuld's next steps, well, it's still up in the air, he's entered the transfer portal, but where he'll end up remains uncertain. But one thing's for sure, it's going to be a tough road ahead for him, likely similar to McLean's journey. McLean, you see, blamed Deion Sanders for his decision to leave Colorado and expressed frustration with the program's recruiters when seeking a new opportunity. So, there you have it, folks. The fallout from Kuhl's actions is causing waves within the Buffaloes community, and it looks like it's going to be a bumpy ride for him moving forward. Stay tuned for more updates, and don't forget to like and subscribe for all the latest sports news. Thanks for watching, and I'll catch you next time.